These roots are so interwoven and taut that it's impossible to get through them. These roots are so interwoven and taut that it's impossible to get through them. on my blade. Then let's go! Carantz, do you need something? I must leave you. See you later. There is a residue. It looks as if something had been placed here. She passed through here, there's no doubt of it. But how was she able to get past these roots? This stone steely has something to do with the entry of the grotto. But how? Do you have any ideas? These roots protect a sacred passage that the Doné Gada wants not just anyone to take. You are correct to believe the steely is bound to the entrance. You need to make an offering. 
In general, you place a seed of a particular plant chosen by the Donega that sealed the grotto. How to know which seed to place? And where would we find one? The easiest way is to ask someone who has already passed through the passage. There is a good chance that the Voglendike has already taken it with his mistress and could help us. Thank you, Siora. Your wisdom has been a great help to us. Were you able to meet the Tierna Hakkadaktas? Yes, but to my grave disappointment, she fled before I could expose my arguments. Yes, many strangers have tried to capture her many times. She must have decided you were one of them. I am once again in need of your assistance. I must take the passage blocked by a door of roots. You had the honor of speaking with my mistress. If she chose to follow the sacred passage, then it is that she had nothing more to say to you. Why would I share with you the understanding of the ritual that protects her? I promise that I mean her no harm. I just need to expose as best I can the problem at hand. Her help is truly necessary. Thousands of lives are at stake. Tell me more. My people have fallen prey to a serious illness, which has almost certainly taken my own mother by now. If we do not quickly find a remedy, we shall all follow her to the grave. But the Tiana Hakadactus can help us. We are sure of that. She will know of a remedy able to heal this sickness that plagues us. Your quest seems noble and with great respect for the life of all. You must feed the offering ward to enter into the passage and meet her once again. I need to place a seed on the stone steely, don't I? Yes, you must make this offering. I cannot tell you from which plant it is given, but there is a chance there are more in her dwelling. I will let you enter this one time, but treat her dwelling with respect, I ask you. Thank you for your help. Do not be so eager to thank me. The place you enter is ripe with dangers. As do all sacred places, it defends itself with the wild beasts that it fosters. This passage leads to a forest where the ancestors of the Tierna Hakkadaktas makes her home. And why should I fear the ancestor? I have stories of the Nadaig being shared with you. In your language, you would call them guardians. Yes, I counted one. She was magnificent. Then you know of what I speak. I must leave. these crushed plants and these powders. She must have been preparing a potion. It might be the miraculous remedy. <sighs> to be so close and yet to have no idea what to do with all this. All of this is extremely interesting, but alas, it won't help me open the root passage. This bark is covered with little symbols. It looks like some sort of writing, though I've been led to believe the natives have no written language. <sighs> The Donegada use these symbols amongst themselves, and only they understand their meaning. It is a secret and sacred language. I cannot reveal to you what the bark contains without breaking my bond. Can you at least tell me if they speak of a passage? A sea? No. I would have told you. All of this is extremely interesting, but alas, it won't help me open the root passage. This plant looks familiar. I saw some not far from here. Unfortunately, it has lost its seeds. This looks like a collection of skulls from various animals. I wonder what purpose they serve. These skulls symbolize the animals. Through some rituals, we greet them. We thank them for feeding and dressing us, so that the next hunting season, they will once again give us the weak amongst their herds. I don't see any seeds here. The only clue we have is this plant. Let's try to find some other flowers. It might be their seed that opens the passage.
all these flowers. Perhaps this is where the Tiena Hakodactus finds the seeds that we're looking for. These flowers are similar to those we found in the dwelling of the Tiena Hak, and they bear seeds. Those are the offering seeds we need to open the root passage. We should go try them. It is truly pastoral. Seeds, knotted roots. Oh, how I miss the ocean. We have what we need. Let's go back to the stone steely. It looks very ancient. I wonder what treasures it contains. Be respectful. We are in a sacred passage, which is for initiation and meditation. We did not come to defile this place, and we do well to hurry. The Tiena Hakodactus is quite the head start. There's a chasm here. 
The Tierna Hach Kadachthas is agile. She must have jumped over it. We cannot go this way. There has to be another path. my blade. Let on my back. And let's go! Poison on my blade. And let's go!
These are a nice. <laughs> <laughs> 